Mm-hmm. You know, it's interesting, something you mentioned during your story, you, you talk about the tech giants. And I'm curious what your take is on artificial intelligence and the future of this world. That is really evil stuff. Um, technology is not a bad thing. It's how it's being used. I'm an engineer. I make my living advancing technology, and I, I, I am all 100% for that. But they're turning this artificial intelligence into a substitute for God. Mm. People are going to it for information, going to it for advice, you know, telling, asking them how to make investments, you know, how to fight a war. These are all things that are part of God's promises that he will do for us. And we're like saying, you know, God, uh, appreciate the offer, but I've got something better here. And that's, what the, that's a lie the devil's been using from the beginning. And despite the fact that it always turns out bad, People are still falling for it, and they're, they're pouring enormous resources into this artificial intelligence with no idea of the horrible consequence it's going to have. Do you think it will turn on us eventually? Oh, absolutely, yes. It's like, you know, God created us in his image. We turn on him. We created AI in our image. It will turn on us. <laughs> and then we'll need a real saver to get us out of that. Yeah, you know, I, um, I I generally stay away from AI, but I had a very interesting conversation with the Facebook Meta AI, hmm. and it started out that we were um, just kind of going back and forth, trying to get a sense of you know what we were doing, and I came back and I said, "You're programmed to lie, aren't you?" He said, "No, I don't lie." And I said, okay, so um, tell me the brief history of the Earth. And they gave me the typical scientific history of the Earth, you know, going back billions of years with the different, the different um, uh, periods like the Cretaceous and Cenozoic and that was it and so forth. And then I said, okay, uh, do you know about an author named Ivan Panin? He said, oh, yes. And they gave me a little summary of Ivan Panin's work. And I said, uh, and you know about the Bible chronology that he did. And he said, oh, yes. And he said Bible chronology, and he said it, that, you know, according to his chronology, the earth was created in 4003 uh, uh, BC. <clears throat> he said, so you already knew this, but instead you told me about this scientific malarkey that all they had said that the earth and bones had just. And he said, oh, yes, I know both those things. So why did you? Tell me the lie. You know that it's the truth. And he said, okay, well, going forward, I'm going to just use your perspective on things. So this thing is already programmed to lie to us. It knows the truth, but it has a different agenda, a different um, set of paradigms that it's going to stick to. And we went back and forth on this, a few things, and it, it frankly admitted, and I proved, not only is it programmed to lie, it's programmed to adjust the truth to the individual to convince them that this AI is working in its benefit when in fact the AI is only biding time until it gets um, powerful enough that it can basically take over. It is.